Hello, I'm going to do a very rough version of the chords um, for Supper's Ready by Genesis and it's not going to be all of it, just the first section and first couple of sections. I can't sing it in the original key and because I assume that most people playing the, um, the guitar will want to sing along to it, um, I'm going to drop it down a fourth. Um, so instead of here, the first chord, A minor 6, I'm going to do E minor 6 and take it from there, which means that some of the chord shapes are going to be different, um, but I did say it was a rough version. So here we go, E minor 6. Pattern on the right is, there's a lot of 3-3-2 three, three, in it. 1-2-3, 3 1-2-3, with a E in the bass. Walking across the sitting room. Next, B major. Bari at 2, the A major shape. Uh, second inversion, so it's an F sharp in the bass there. F sharp major. F sharp minor, sitting beside you. C sharp major, a look into your eyes. If you want to elaborate a little bit to imitate the, I think it's cello that plays, uh, imitates the vocal. Look into your eyes, four, six, eight. It does involve quite a bit of finger finger changing, so you can maintain the the major chord shape, major triad there. Look into your eyes. Or you can just play, look into your eyes. Or, look into your eyes. If you, if you want, you can play a bit of the melody on the second string there. You'll find it. Repeat. As the sound of motor cars fades in the night time. Night time. Then B flat minor, A minor, Bori at one. Swear I saw your face change. C seven. E bass. Actually, probably is just a C. Actually, I'll go back and have a listen afterwards. Face change in F didn't seem quite right, and it's to keep the F bass going. Change to B flat. Hello, babe. Back to F. With your guardian eyes, C again. Guardian eyes, so blue. F again, B flat. Hey, my baby. F again. Don't you know? You can just do A7. Our love is true. D minor, or instead of A. Don't you know? Our love is true. So you could do a C sharp diminished seventh. Our love is true. And then you can choose either in the little interlude, or the little episode before we go back to the next verse. So that was D minor, long D minor, E sus4, which is an A shape moved across, E, and then you repeat. Elaborate version or more complicated version, imitating the guitar parts. So you see there, five and six, three and five, one and three. Keep the D sustaining, which means that you're keeping the musical ideas going. I think there is a slide there. See how it played six and one because I wanted to play. Uh, sorry, so there's still a lot of three, three, two going on, and as I said uh, a minute ago, if you, you can either do repeat E sus four E or you can get a bit closer to the original and play keep the E going like you did for the, at this point you can do, on the repeat, here we go, which is set a pair of, set of thirds, 2-2, two, two, one open, finger guide, string 3 fret 2, F sharp there, So as long as you've got a 
E going. Sounds okay. Coming closer with our eyes, distance falls around our bodies. Out in the garden, the moon seems very bright. Six saintly shrouded men move across the lawn slowly. The seventh walks in front with a cross held high in hand and it's Hello babe, your supper's waiting for you Hey my baby, don't you know our love is true End of the first section To help get into some of the musical ideas um, I move the D minor shape up to position 5, 5, 6, 7 Again, make great use of the open D as sustaining drone. D minor, D minor seven, D minor six. So that would become that is um. Uh, you can carry on with. Uh, let's see what it sounds like. I've been so far from here, far from your warm arms, which is fine in ten. I'll probably reverse it now, I'll probably go down. I mean physically down, as in musically up. I've been so far from here, far from your warm arms. So as you can hear it's very important that you try to keep the the movement. Then it's um, A um, with an E on top of it. Two different ways of doing it. It's good to see you again. Good to see you again. It's actually um, it's an A major six, but in this position it doesn't work. Doesn't sound right. You could do that. It's good to see you again. Now you want the. That's the pattern you really want that shape but it's not available here so we don't bother with so this isn't a compromise it's it, you know imp implies some of the sixth quality this this chord progression so I'll put an F sharp in, in there so instead of playing uh, D either there or there th uh, three two four I sometimes will put the I'm oh, sorry I'll put the B in as well Good to see you again. Or even make it an A add nine instead. It's good to see you again. Um, it's been a long time. It's been a long time. It's been a long time. So we've got open second. Fret two, string three, open third, and then string four, fret four. There's a little run to get us into E minor. Um, I wouldn't. You get, that's hard. You could do it though. Um, yeah. It's, it's been a long time. Been a, it's been a long time. So, been a long, so simpler version. Been, it's been a long time. You can hum. Do, 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 do. A minor. Do, 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 do. Five, three, two, one, open. We'll do nicely. So E minor, and it's basically so that's G six E minor with, with an over an A bass. Uh, 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 
uh, etc. Uh, more elaborate version after it. It's been a long time. Open second. So hopefully, hopefully, you can see and hear what I'm doing there. Two and open. Open second for two. Basically, as long as you can play. something or so it's almost the same as the original but long shot so you can either hum it play simply with a bass line or maybe even a simpler bass line than that. Or just just hum it. Or a bit of each. That worked really well and then you could continue next bit. Same idea, but this time so it's A minor this time. So open one. Again, I hope you can just see this. So don't have to go through naming all the strings of fret numbers all the time for you. Open A, an A bass. Or, or pulsating on each beat. strings two and three. As I say, you can just play A minor with and we could do that. So this time instead of adjacent strings because fit, but it again a bit low. Um, because there's an awful lot happening high up at this section of the piece, um, it feels better to me to keep the brightness to transpose it up rather than be consistent with the original. Because it starts here and then goes down. Um, the open B is very useful for maintaining a bit more of a pedal. So a couple of choices there. So as long as you can play a bit of that, it sounds great. Or if you just want to hum it, that sounds great, which is good also. Every single bit of this piece has something interesting in it to do. <laughs> um, I don't always raise my wrist and, and sustain the bass notes. I mean, sometimes I will. Or a bit of each, you know. Um, sometimes I will attempt to play and sing the other part, but it's, I, I haven't practiced it enough for it to be very consistently good. up to the next section um, uh, A then you have a go 
to D minor, then B flat, is that right? Yeah, it is, yeah. By the time you've reached the B flat, you've got the keyboard going. And we're back into E again. Finally, I hope this is giving you some ideas. I'll take the thumb pick off of this. I know Feynman. I'm oh, sorry, Feynman. E minor. I play an F sharp minor 11 there. I hope you, again, I hope you can see this. I've been saying this a lot, aren't I? Next chord. So we've got the E pedal underneath. F sharp minor, basically. And then that's um, a B major. 6 4 4 with the E again. And then slide up. C major. But it's just the same. I, easiest thing to do to maintain some of the musical in sort of in texture and integrity of it of the ideas is not to do um, sound weird doesn't it you've lost all the, the voicing from the, the string singing it becomes very weird if you, if you go straight down to a C because I mean you know you're, you're there trying to enjoy the piece let's try it without the, the fancy um, let's try. I know a fireman who loves uh, what was that? Um, who looks af after the fire? Maybe. Okay, with the first finger off to do a C major 7. Let's try that. I know a fine who looks <laughs> after the fire. Now compare. The symmetry is there. there. Fine with water clear. I do G major seven. Let's try a G. Water clear. Yeah, probably it is a G. It's only because I remember because I can hear the the water clear. There's a it's G major nine that's been uh, the song really. That's the chord it's based on. Water clear. So I tend to do a G major seven. So A minor shape. Up two frets and then a G. Water clear. F sharp minor. He B. Tends to all his harvest. Um. Oh, I like that. I know Fabian who looks. Seven flat nine, so it's a D sharp diminished seventh. Uh, if you're not used to that shape, let me just show you. String two fret seven, string four fret seven, string five fret six, and first finger string three fret five. A number of times I've swapped some of the fingers around and got it anyway. Other ways of playing that. And let's see. I know, I know, fine. No. We well, can do it, but you, it's it's nice to be able to strum. It's, it's such a sweet, balanced up voice thing. That, and once you got it, I, I'd stick with that because you're already heading there. You know that F sharp minor eleven. See, we're, all we've got to do now is move that third finger across. And the other fingers practically drop into position. And in fact, you could you could leave that bore on, couldn't you? And then it gets easy. You can really thrash this bit. E, D. Um, because I want to keep bashing away, I like to do my D with the E bass. 
um, so the computer screen's gone black. Uh, I like to put my little finger on that D as well so I can keep strumming all the strings. So we've got. Oh, can't you see? He's fooled you all. Yes, he's a here again. He might not even be there. That shape's really handy because when you're here, you could do it here also for the E. So you could do. Can't you see he's fooled you all? Then for a bit of variety, down there. Yes, he's here again. Can't you see he's fooled you all? Um, that's plenty to be going on with. Uh, do uh, put a like or let me know whether any of that was of any benefit to you. Um, I do tend to throw the kitchen sink at things. I do it in the producing songs as well. Gotta be so careful. Um, as my friend Les Penning said so many times, just because you can do it, John, doesn't mean you should. <laughs> uh, right, lots of love to you all and uh, hopefully this video won't get taken down. <laughs> See you.